Hey amazing creators, welcome back to the channel. Today in this video we are going to show you how to create a cinematic clean text reveal in Filmora 14. Want to learn? Keep watching! Before we begin, if you haven't already installed Wondershare Filmora, please visit the official website and download the latest version, then install it on your computer. Also remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Cinematic texts play a crucial role in setting the tone and mood of any video project. They are used to establish a visual style and engage the audience from the very beginning. Usages of cinematic text. Setting the tone and mood. Enhancing visual appeal. Creating a professional look. Driving narrative and emotion. Let's see how to create a clean cinematic text reveal in Filmora. First, launch Filmora and import your background footage. Then, place the background footage onto the timeline. Now go to the titles and place the default title onto the timeline, and then adjust the title according to the footage length. Then, change the font to any cinematic font. You can use these fonts in this project. Then, enter your text like cinematic title and adjust the font size. Then, expand the layout option and increase the letter spacing. Now we will use a position keyframe to make text slide from left to right. Place the playhead at any duration of your liking. Then go to the position and on keyframe. Then place the playhead at the beginning of the title and change the position of the text towards the left side. Then go to the next keyframe and adjust the title position. Now click on this diamond mark to open the speed graph editor. Select the position X and then select the second keyframe and from Graph Presets, select Curve. This will make your text travel fast and gradually slow down at the end. Next, we will add an Opacity keyframe. Place the playhead at the half mark from the second position keyframe. Add an Opacity keyframe. Then at the beginning, change the Opacity to zero. You can even adjust the Opacity and keyframe position as you like. Now, place the playhead a second before the end and add an opacity keyframe. Then at the end, change the opacity to zero. Now, duplicate the title on the above track, change the font and text. Then adjust the font position and change the font start point to the right side. And then shrink the title from the start and adjust the keyframe position. If you wish, you can change the second font size and make it a bit smaller than the main text. And you will get this neat and clean animation. Next, we will add a blur effect. For that, first select both the titles and convert them to a compound clip. Then we will apply Gaussian Blur. For that, go to the effects. And then to Boris FX, go to the Blur folder and apply Gaussian Blur onto the compound clip. Then place the playhead at the start and in the effects setting, change the blur to 24, and on the blur keyframe, then go further and change the blur to zero. Then place the playhead one second before the end, add a blur keyframe, and then a few frames before the end, change the blur to 24. Then, at the final step, add a shadow to the text to create a sense of depth. Now, let's render the project to see the preview. There are many ways to create a text reveal in Filmora. You can even use different cinematic title presets. Download Filmora 14 from the link in the description and start creating. If you found it helpful, give us a big thumbs up and share it with fellow creators and editors. If you are interested in visual effects and tutorials, check out filmora.wondershare.com. See you in the next video.